This is a genetic defect. Do I have a reason to breed this dog? It's 90 pounds, 15 inches? Yeah, I'm breeding the dog, I'm sorry. I'm breeding the dog. I don't have a problem with the Merles. So I know that ABKC somehow says no. I remember a time where Dave was all about Merles. Um, other people weren't, and it was a back and forth. It's a color. It's no different than anything else. I hear people say, oh, it's a genetic defect. There's dingoes that are Merle in the wild. They live. I'll say one thing about Nikos. On. You know? he, he studies a lot. So yeah. it's not, he does, do, does no, just he doesn't. No, he doesn't. He looks into it. There is no proof, scientifically speaking. You will never find, you'll find an AKC journal. AKC is written by breeders, by the way, not by scientists. Uh, you'll find maybe a UKC journal. You'll find maybe some breeder journal. Some Joe Schmo who wrote a book. Those are not facts. Facts are something that's done in a laboratory with a study with real medical scientists and doctors over a period of time of a study and they write a journal down. You will never find a journal that says that Merle is a defect in dogs. You will never find it. I've challenged people every day. Yeah, there is, there is. Show it to me. No one showed it to me. I have looked, I have looked, I have never found anything. Listen, you're in a privileged position to learn a thing or two. Keep your mouth shut and your eyes open. The fruits of the earth are not brought to perfection immediately, but by time, rain, and care. Similarly, the fruits of men ripen through ascetic practice, study, time, perseverance, self-control, and patience. Just like a lot of other things about how old the dog should be when you breed it, or how you should breed a dog, and what you... All these things are breeder, he say, she say, blah, 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 blah. None of them are facts. Um, you have to look up facts. You can't just listen to people talk. They've been repeating things for dozens of years. They think just because it's an old mentality that it's the right thing. I didn't breed these dogs on an old mentality. I brought on a new mentality, a new strategy, a new way, by studying and looking into it myself. That's how I got where I am today. If I listened to other people and did the things they did back in the day, I wouldn't be here today. I promise you that. I'd have a bunch of pits, we'd be all whippets over here, and I would have been out of business. And I would have quit. So, there is such a thing as breeding a balance. And people need to stop confusing handicap, confirmation. Handicap and confirmation. If your dog has a kink in the tail, it's not a handicap. It's not a handicap. The dog is not affected for life. Okay? It's not a handicap. That's just... You favor a dog with a perfect tail for the show ring. The dog that's got a king tail might outlive your dog with a full tail and Fact. be healthier and move better than that dog. That doesn't mean nothing. It's just a defect. A dog with a slight underbite is not a handicap. Now, with a severe underbite, he can't chew. It's going into his gums. Maybe so. But a slight underbite is not. So just because your dog has a scissor bite and that dog has a slight underbite, that doesn't make your dog a better dog. It's not a handicap. It's a confirmation issue. So yes, we want to better the confirmation for the ring. But I'm not going not gonna to breed a healthy dog because it has a slight underbite or has a slight kink in the tail or has a slight toe that's too big versus the other. You know, none of us are created perfect. None of us two hands are the same. You know what I mean? None of us. Not one of us. God did not create perfection in humans, animals, or trees, or anything. We find defects in everything. Yet, we can pretend to be able to create better than God. We can we can't, we just have to remember, this is a handicap, we don't want to breed it because a dog will suffer. This is a handicap, we don't want to breed it because a dog will suffer. This is a handicap, we don't want to breed it because a dog will suffer. This is a genetic defect. Do I have a reason to breed this dog? It's 90 pounds, 15 inches? Yeah, I'm breeding the dog, I'm sorry. I'm breeding the dog. And I have been humiliated and disappointed. Fuck me, fuck me, fuck me, come on, fuck me. He may not perfect show dog, but he's not sick, he's not a handicap, he's gonna live a normal life. I can fix that confirmation with a better extreme cleaner dog between the two together I'm building another generation of a better dog keeping the better one out of the stock and at the same time keeping the pool gene extreme all the way across not by going back to some pit bull dog that's, that's gonna take me generations back right so we have no problem this is social media this is this is for fun we keep it entertaining for people and uh, and that's what it's about it's just fun and game Garrett, stop doing it stop it stop I'm done with it. I'm done. Absolutely. Everybody's winning at the end of the day. And that, that's what comes today. We had fun. A bunch of us here today. We're going to have some drinks. We're going to have some food. You know, that, that's what it's about. Just a good time. You know? 
Master. Perhaps a demonstration is in order. No, that is the last thing that is in order. Oh, Poor fruity character. Leave him alone. <sighs> Gather around, gang. Dinner time. All right, that's it. I'm out of here. <laughs>